Another spring training is underway, the fourth for Brett Laurie as a member of the Blue Jays. He's another year older and another year wiser. It was at this time last year the club brought in infielder Mark DeRosa to help mentor their young third baseman, a move that ended up working very well for the team and for Laurie himself. Uh, it was a great building year for me last year because Mark helped me uh, through the tough times when I was scuffling a little bit and just told me to keep plugging away, keep, keep doing my thing. And Mark was great because I got to take ground balls with him every single day. Um, and uh, he was really great for me. To say Brett Laurie wears his heart on his sleeve would be an understatement. To say he can't control his emotions might be an overstatement. His temper is evident, but his memory is short. Battling to get back onto the field and, and get back out there and do what I always love to do. And uh, you know what, I, I, you know, as far as, you know, I used to say that, you know, I'm not going to change. I think I've changed. and I think the game helps you change throughout as you play it throughout a full long season. Uh, you learn a lot of stuff. But uh, my mentality towards the game and how hard I play, that'll never stop. Um, I wear my heart on my sleeve and, and that's how I do things and uh, you know if something doesn't go right you know I may be a little busted up uh, for a hot minute but you know there's always the next play and that's what I do know. Positiveness all, towards all umpires you know what I don't feel like I have to convince anybody because I'm not going to go out there every day looking to convince umpires I'm going out there to play baseball that's hard enough as it is I can't go out there looking to impress other people you know we're both out there doing our jobs and uh, you know that's kind of the way it goes you know I'm just going to go out there and continue doing what I'm doing. If Laurie is rubbing some people the wrong way, the Blue Jays are willing to live with it. As much criticism as he takes from outside the organization for his emotion, he's actually quite popular amongst his teammates. And his defense receives high praise from around the league, including a perennial all-star who just happens to stand next to him on the infield. I don't know what the Jays think when they try to make Laurie a second base. I mean, for me personally, he's one of the best third basemen defensive-wise in the game. I mean, you know, he's unbelievable. Good range, I mean. Meanwhile, at the plate, there have been ups and downs. But in the second half of 2013, Laurie showed signs of becoming a more complete offensive force. His new hitting coach, Kevin Seitzer, sees unlimited potential at what he can accomplish. I told him yesterday, I mean, just watching him hit just gets, I get the blood flowing in my body like it's like, my gosh, I've never seen so much talent in one place that it just needs to needs to be brought out. I see myself not, you know, I have goals for myself, but at the same time, let's take one game at a time and go and have some fun and, and know that I can't hit six home runs every game. So I uh, know that there's 162 of them and just look to do something positive for the team every day. And it's that positive thinking that has the Blue Jays hopeful for a strong 2014. Barry Davis, Sportsnet, Dunedin.